Yo, Fuzzy Beth here. Today, let's learn how to make a coin collect system. Uh, but this time, instead of it being the entire base plate, it's going to be a specific area. Now, what I mean by this is that you guys obviously see this square terrain. And I only want it, I set it up so that the coin collection system is literally only within this terrain area. So this is what we are going to be working towards too. A huge shout out to Boxrum, an amazing developer community member uh, for Buzzy Games for helping out with this code and this project. So if you haven't watched my previous how to make a coin collect system just for your base plate, watch that first because we'll be kind of adding on to the scripts that we've made in that previous video. Now, inside of server storage, we had our coin, our coin there, right? And this was the script that we left off at. Now, we want to go ahead and spice it up and go ahead and make the coin actually spin. So all we're adding is just making sure that our coin is able to just spin in a circle and it just spins in place and that's it. So if you did watch my previous coin collecting system, then you should have already uh, created a leader stats folder. But if you didn't, it should look a little something like this. Sweet. So once we're done with that, we're going to go ahead and create our specific spawn area part. So basically this part is where all of our coins will be um, spawning in. So for our part, just make sure you tick, uh, untick can collide as well as can carry. And then let's go ahead and add a script inside of this part. Okay, so we have a variable for our coin, which is inside of server storage. We have the a spawn area, which is just our part, as well as a variable for the max amount of coins possible um, to be spawned in this part. And of course we have a debounce. Now for our first function, it's going to find the position of the coin inside of our part. And then for our second function, the random V2 is going to place our coins inside of that specific spawn area now for our spawn coin function it's going to get the random position using our spawn area for the zone and we're actually going to go ahead and create a raycast so to filter out the spawn area so coins don't spawn on it now if the info is nil then that means that there was no surface for the coin to spawn on Okay, so we're going to go ahead and create a new coin in our spawn area. And it's going to make sure that it spawns in the position where it's just uh, hitting right above the or it's hitting right above the uh, surface position. And then we're going to go ahead and create a loop, a while true do loop. We're going to get a table of all the children of coins. So as you guys can see, there is a coins folder inside of workspace. And if hashtag coins is less than max coins, then the coins will spawn. Else, if we have more than 15 coins, which is the max coins, then field will be equal to true and task is going to be wait, task wait. So that means no more coins will be spawned until there are less than 15 coins. Okay, so let's go ahead and test out our hard work and you'll see that right away that there are a bunch of coins spawns in that specific part. Now, what's really cool is that because we set a raycast, so what I'm going to do is actually head back to my workspace area and bring over the terrain part. And I'm going to go ahead and make sure that my spawn uh, part, the spawn area part, the part where the coins will be spawning on, it actually just covers the entire terrain. So not by height, just like literally the length and width of it. And what's really cool is that um, when we go ahead and test out the game, the coins, instead of literally spawning under you know, the terrain or directly on the uh, part, it spawns on the surface of the terrain. And you guys will see what I mean in just a second. And you see, how cool is that? 
If you guys enjoyed this content, please give us a like and a subscribe. Full scripts and models will be posted on our website at buzzy.gg, link in the description. As always, have fun creating and I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace.